Welcome back everybody. Okay, we need to talk about cats in video games. These days we've got Stray, where you play as a cat in a futuristic cyberpunk dystopia. You even get to knock things over and claw at the walls. It's the simulator for the cat-loving masses. In Cyberpunk 2077, another game set in a cyberpunk dystopia, canonically all the dogs had died out and there were just hairless rat-looking cats everywhere. Heck, we've even got games like Cat Quest 1 and 2 where you get to play as a cat in a medieval fantasy RPG. Now listen, the Rue is known to be frequently felonious to felines, and it's odd that there have been so few dogs, playable or otherwise, in recent games. You know what this is? You know what this is? This is pro-cat propaganda. All this messaging and information about how it's only cats that are gonna be able to survive the dystopian future we're headed for is just ridiculous. This, right here, this, this is the work of the Illuma Meowdy. We all need to look-